Bikes get back on the winning track with a 49 to six victory over uh, South Tama tonight. Uh, first of all, uh, Coach Post, uh, hour 40 uh, weather delay beforehand. Uh, what do you do uh, to uh, keep your team uh, focused and uh, fresh uh, during uh, that Mother Nature interruption? Well, Darren, I, I got a compliment our kids. Uh, they want, they were ready to play. They wanted to play, and you know we got through the whole, almost the whole pregame warm up, and then the lightning came and they delayed it. And I don't know how long it was—an hour, two hours, hour and a half, whatever—that we sat in the gym. But they, they kept their focus. They just came in the gym, sat down, and relaxed. Took their pad, their pads off, and. Uh, Listened to their iPads and their or their iPods and their music and uh, just kept their composure. I got give I got to compliment our guys. They did a really nice job of, of keeping themselves focused on what they on the, uh, the task at hand. And uh, coming out and returning the opening kickoff for a score that's a pretty good way to start a game, uh, correct? <laughs> yeah, I mean uh, you know we've been talking all year about we can break one of these. We got to break one of these. And by golly, we broke we, we almost broke two of them tonight. Yep. And we had great, you know good punt returns also. I mean. Um, some good blocking on it. I mean, uh, you watch the films here. There, uh, there's a couple of blocks that took place in that one punt return. It was it was pretty awesome. Uh, so I was pretty pretty impressed with our return teams. We've we've been doing well all year on them, and uh, you know we did the same thing against uh, those opponents last week and two weeks ago, but we couldn't quite break one all the time. But um, and these the guys are working hard at it and they're believing in it, and uh, we got some good guys, you know, return guys with some shiftiness and speed and some good savvy on when to make the cuts. Uh, so we're able to get some good yardage on it. So it's it's been fun. And you mentioned uh, Jake and uh, Drake gets a lot of well-deserved credit for what they can do uh, once the ball's in their hands. But the other ten guys uh, obviously are doing a pretty good job too. Right, that's what I was referring to. There was a, on that one punt return, I think of, of uh, Drake's uh, coming down our sideline there. It was a uh, there was some uh, two really outstanding blocks. I think Avery Duggar made one, and uh, I can't remember who the other one was. Uh, and Jake, I know, made a couple of nice blocks, and so did uh, Drake uh, on some of them. So, but those guys, they block well for each other. You know, one whoever catches the ball, the other guy does a good job of, of setting up and blocking for him, and so we can get those guys started. It's important to get that first, you know, five ten yards get started, so they can get their momentum going and. Uh, those two guys complement each other that way very well. And uh, the rushing game obviously struggled the last couple of weeks, but uh, tonight uh, you ran the ball for uh, 235 yards, and when your first play uh, breaks for about 56, does that kind of put everybody at ease? Well, it does for a little while, yeah. But you, <laughs> you know, you always hope that you know is that was that a, uh, a fluke thing, or did we actually uh, block it well enough, and we'll continue to block it? But uh, our blocking was much much better against the team, uh, this team tonight. Uh, uh, that just goes to show you, you know, that uh, we're, we're capable of blocking them. But th those defenses that we went against these last two weeks were pretty good. Uh, if we, you know, we could do that, you know, against South Tama, and uh, we weren't quite able to do that against uh, these other teams. So there's a, there's a couple of really good teams in our league. And uh, defensively, uh, continuing to play well, give up only six points tonight. Uh, give up only uh, 227 yards. They had their backs against the wall a couple of times, and they rose to the occasion, didn't they? Yeah, that, that was that was pretty impressive. That one time they were down inside. I think they were inside the 20 yard line or whatever, and they were and we, we turned them back. And uh, uh, so that, that that's really a good effort by our defensive line. I thought played well again tonight, putting pressure on them, stopping the run, and then our, our pass coverage. Uh, uh, once we got kind of got into the flow of things, uh, we made a couple of really great plays. Uh, I know Drake Shelton made an, you know, a really nice play there with the deep ball that uh, the guy was, if he'd have caught it, he'd have been gone, and he made a diving uh, stop there. So we, the guys are making some good effort and doing good efforts. Is it past your bedtime? Uh, just about. Uh, <laughs> by the time we get home, it will be. So uh, we got to, you know, I'll take it. Uh, it was, it was it's been a long night, and uh, the, the guys, uh, as I said, they have stuck in there very well. The coaches have done a good job of coaching them up and getting them ready to play this game. And uh, now we got to get ready for Charles City, who always is a, a good Northeast Iowa Conference opponent again. And we know what those guys, those types of teams are like. So we got to be ready for them next week. Congrats on the victory. Enjoy it till uh, Sunday afternoon when you guys get together and uh, start prepping for Chucktown. Okay, will do. Thank you, Darren.